And welcome back to Second Cup on WTXL.TV. I'm Brian Jackson, the Hang Tough Foundation Executive Director. Janelle Irwin is here this morning to tell us about Cascades Goals Gold. Thank you so much for joining us Thanks this morning. Thanks for having us. How did you come up with that, with that name? Cascades goals gold. So gold is Pediatric Cancer Awareness Month, and uh, my son had leukemia when he was he was diagnosed when he was 11 months old, and he is now a first grader and doing really well. But um, Hang Tough Foundation, when we started, we started because of our children that had cancer, and so. It's such a fun event where we turn the waterfalls at Cascades gold. And so cool. Cascades literally is going to go gold in honor of Pediatric Cancer Awareness Month. Now, were you uh, part of this uh, organization before you found out that your son had cancer? So I started it uh, myself and Michelle Hart, another um, mother that had a daughter with leukemia. Um, we started it in February of 2015 um, as my son was nearing the end of his treatment. Um, we saw a need in Tallahassee to rally around families, not just with pediatric cancer, but any kind of diagnosis. Because um, no matter the diagnosis, it affects every member of the family in a different right. way. So we, we seek to support those family members during their journey. Now, how does an event like this kind of help support the families who are kind of going through this? You know, it's a great event where we bring everybody together. And the, I think the biggest impact it has is showing these families that there's a community out there that loves and supports them. Uh, in the past couple of years when we've done this, we've had two to 300 people come out and just stand right. behind these families as we honor those that are currently fighting recognize our survivors but also we do a remembrance walk of those heroes that we've lost too soon and just having a a group of people walk behind those parents that are they're suffering their with their loss um, and just knowing there's people that love and support them on their journey is now I was looking through some of the pictures for this and you've actually had a lot of people come out who maybe don't even have a family member who's really impacted this mm -hmm. so what does that kind of mean for this organization to know that people who may not be directly impacted are coming out to support you guys. I tell you, the Tallahassee community is phenomenal and they, they look for opportunities to, to rally around these families and support them. So it means the world to us to know that, you know, even if they haven't been locally impacted, they can imagine what it was like, what it, what it would be like to have a child with cancer or they know someone who's, who's been through that journey. And so the fact that they want to jump out and just show their support is incredible. And uh, what kind of vendors or what can people who come out on Thursday kind of expect to see? So it's a completely free event, open to the public. There will be over 25 vendors out there all hosting activities for kids, cornhole, and there'll be face painting and <laughs> all sorts of things, balloon animals, you name it. It's, it's, we're going to take over the park. We're going to have a really good time. There's going to be pizza provided by Dave's Pizza Garage. So, and again, it's all free. So come out, bring the family, um, and, and, support these families that have been through the unthinkable. Now is this kind of also another opportunity for families who are all kind of going through the same thing to kind of share those stories and kind of encourage each other as well? Absolutely, absolutely. And you'll see, you'll see several families that will actually speak about their experience with pediatric cancer. But what's so cool is because Hang Tough is all inclusive of all diagnoses, you'll see our families that have other children with other diagnoses there as well and, and having those conversations. And so it's really cool to bring everybody together. Now, what's been your best memory of this event so far? Because this will be, I believe, the fourth year of it's it? It's the fifth year fifth this year. year. I um, can't count clearly this morning. Yeah. You know, it's, it, it changes every year. And I, I think the most meaningful thing to me um, as a mom is the remembrance walk that we added a couple years ago where we actually we recognize uh, currently we're at nine heroes in the Tallahassee region that we've lost to pediatric cancer and that's the most meaningful to me that we have this opportunity to remember them and uh, that they're never forgotten and they are at the forefront of our minds all the time. And uh, what kind of support have you guys gotten from the city to be able to kind of take the park over for a night and even turn the waterfalls gold. Yeah, and it's really cool. This year we got a grant from the CRA to really bump up the event, make it better, which is why there's food provided and things like that. So we're so thankful um, for the city allowing us to use their park. They've, all five years it's been at Cascades and they've always turned the waterfall gold for us. And um, it's been really cool to see the city rally around this and proclamations making it Pediatric Cancer Awareness Month. And uh, this event will take place on Thursday, September the 5th from 6 to 8 p.m. It's going to be at Cascades Park at 101 South Gatson Street. It's going to be free to attend. For more information, mm -hmm. you can visit the website, hangtoughfoundation.org. They will paint Cascades Park gold. It'll be a really, really great event on Thursday evening. Uh, so make sure you guys check it out. We'll have much more of this information listed on our website. That's WTXL.TV. Thank you so much. Thank you. For joining us tonight, or well, tonight, this morning, actually. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> we will have much more Second Cup. We'd like to do a short break. Thank you.